right after I made the video about carrying crystals. I was closing my cabinet doors here and this crystal just like screaming out at me like, please connect with me. This is the raw side. It's a beautiful stone. I don't know what it is, but oh, there it goes. You can see the blue and the black in it. And this is the polished side. Anyhow, um, it starts with an S, but I can't remember what it is. Anyhow, I want to show you what it does to me. And if you connect with Crystals 3-3, you guys, this is something it could do for you. Any stone could do for you. The more that you connect with nature, get, um, you know, to higher states of awareness, higher states of consciousness through connection with any parts of nature. Uh, crystals is just one of them. My shirt looks all crazy right now. I'm just driving me nuts. But anyhow, I'm going to show you what it does. My Kundalini energy is going to start moving. I'll explain to you what's happening. I seen 5-5 five five as I was closing my eyes. I've already been connecting with this for quite some time, so it's kind of just starting up where it was before. I can see roots connecting with the earth. Actually, it looks like really thick tree roots. Felt like it was pushing me backwards, the energy was. All I'm doing is letting the energy cycle from my left hand up my left arm into my heart and around back down into the stone through the right hand. And I uh, am expanding it in all directions as I'm doing so. When it gets to the heart space, you know, I'm just expanding it. That's just intentions when I was upset, but keep doing allowing it to do what it's doing until it's not doing it anymore sometimes it'll be a long time sometimes it won't be long at all Intentions that nobody's entered.